Hey Trev, welcome. Today is Friday, 30th of June, last day of the week, start of a new weekend. And it's also the last day of the month of June, and it's also the last day of the first half of 2023. Yes, halfway in the year already. And we've got another six more months to go till Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I know you guys be saying, oh, don't say that now. <laughs> Christmas. Hmm. I thought we only just celebrated Christmas. <laughs> oh, well. So we've got another six months of mayhem, of life. Life gets in the way. <laughs> yes. And, of course, yesterday was mum, my mum's birthday. Well, she would have turned to 87 yesterday. God bless her. And today, of course, my cousin, my cousin Glennis, um, would have been her birthday today, and um, she was, and she, um, she was tragically killed in a car accident back in 2006, I think, or 2007. I'm not too sure what year it was. I can't remember. <laughs> years have gone by, and you, you tend to forget the years. So um, yes, yeah, she was tragically killed, and um, unfortunately, she lost her life. But she was only 55 years of age then. Mm. So her birthday would be today. Happy birthday, Glennis. I think she'd be somewhere in the 70s by now. Um, yeah, time moves along, doesn't it? Okay, and uh, remember that photo arcade of the guitar, half the guitar case? There's the other one. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's the other guitar case. So you, you saw that one. I well, think that photo needs straightening up, it will. And there's the other one. Yeah. Look at the old photos of me. Me and Peter on the old bikes. That's going back in the 60s. And, of course, we, little me. <laughs> me and Peter, me brother, we're all cowboys. Yeah. Cowboys are cowboys. <laughs> And I ain't being one yet. <coughs> that needs straightening up a bit. It's got blue tack. I'll have to put some stronger tack on there. <laughs> yeah, and some photos. Yeah, that's my late sister Sandra. And Gary. Late brother, Gary. They, they died when they were infants. Um, about that time, sadly, of uh, gastro, gastroenteritis, if I can get the name right, gastroenteritis, I think I got it right, um, it's a bad sickness, and um, during those times, and uh, yeah, would have been a big family by today, yes, so of course on 3rd, I think it's 3rd of July, yeah, 3rd of July, it's coming up um, would be would have been Sandra's birthday. Yeah, I can't remember what age she'll be. She'll probably be about well I'm sixty one. She'd probably be probably fifty eight or fifty nine. I don't know. I'll have to work it out. <laughs> anyway, now in this vlog you'll see some um, back some back clips that I did during last week and um, and this week as well so you'll enjoy that so anyway and also on this vlog I'm gonna put a song up as well I'm gonna sing a song my brand new song Joe and I didn't say goodbye mm, no we didn't so I'm gonna put that up on this vlog so hope you enjoy that okay anyway hope you enjoy the day it is cold day overcast uh, not much sunshine today we haven't been had much sunshine. We had a bit yesterday, had a little bit sun, a little bit of sunshine yesterday, but didn't last long. <laughs> so of course it's winter. We're still in the middle of the winter, and um, we've got another um, couple of months, well, till September, when it will be springtime, spring. Yeah, I'm looking forward to warmer weather. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, and. Um, of course, anybody going to Taylor Swift concert? Yes, 
when she comes to Australia. Of course, Taylor Swift, um, pretty well known by a lot of people, everybody, and a lot of people love to see her. And um, but the tickets, I mean, the concerts. Are, I think, as far as I know, the tickets are absolutely sold out. <laughs> sold out. So um, it could, just goes to show how famous Taylor Swift is. Yeah, it really is. So um, wouldn't, wouldn't, I would love to have her here for a cup of coffee or a cup of tea and a cupcake. <laughs> cupcake. Taylor, if you're, if, you're, if you're watching this vlog, I'll, I'll love to invite you for a cupcake. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Don't tell anybody, <laughs> otherwise this house will be uninundated, full of people. <laughs> when Taylor Swift, if she ever comes here at my place, <laughs> shh. Okay, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Mate Rev, welcome. Today is what day is it? Thursday, Thursday, twenty second of June. Welcome to my new vlog, and um, today it's also, well, today is the longest, well, the shortest day. <laughs> winter solstice, we call this winter. It's winter solstice here. So we've got the short day and a long night. Yes. So, and it's cold. Well, it's not raining or anything like that outside, but we're supposed to be getting some rain, and um, it's quite. Well, it's overcast, but, you know, it's just no rain or anything like that. It's just cold, let me put it that way. <laughs> and uh, so I hope you're having a great day, especially you guys in America, UK. You're celebrating your summer solstice over there. Summertime over there, it's the other way around, isn't it? it you get a short night and a long day. Is that right? <laughs> but you hope you're not swimming out there, making me feel cold. <laughs> well, enjoy, really. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> How's that? What's that? A guitar. Well, it's actually, I made a, um, a, a sort of a, uh, a photo arcade out of my, one of my old guitar cases. It, uh, because that's the one with the hinges that uh, broke and um, it wouldn't work for me, so I tried to put some photos on there. Look at the photos. Yeah, it's me with the guitar. <laughs> mm. Yeah. That was taken at uh, Balan. A place called Balan near Ballarat. Balan Hostel. Yeah. Of course, that's me with my trophy. A Yamaha guitar and a trophy at Portland. I won that. That's the Federation trophy. Yeah, the Federation Cup. And uh, of course, that my little, it's a frame, it's a clock actually, really, a clock. But unfortunately, they got smashed. Mm. So, if you know anybody's got a clock, but, uh, same as that, well, that's the photo is actually black and white. So, I need a photo clock like that, same, to replace it. <laughs> yes, I do, of course. That's me. I'm trying to remember where that is. I don't know. Somewhere. Um, I think that one. I'm not sure which way, where that was taken. Could have been Murderfit. I'm not sure. Murderfit Lodge. <laughs> so I went on a bit of a spending spree yesterday. And uh, I've got some uh, mats. This is a mat for my lounge room. Isn't that lovely? Yeah. It's just to protect my um, the carpet. I mean, these ones I've had these for a while, and one there, I put that one there because um, to protect the the carpet really, because especially with the wheels of the uh, my office chair, it'll only dig into the carpet. So that's why I used my own mat. And uh, in the passageway, my uh, hallway now look at that oh new runner yeah that's a new runner yeah I've got that for the bathroom you can step into the bathroom isn't that beautiful yes and I've got one for my bedroom as well this is my bedroom and uh, 
Yeah, look at that map. <laughs> got that one too, so I've got two of them. So things are looking up. So I've done a bit of a spending spree yesterday. Getting some mat and carpet just to protect the, the carpet underneath. Yeah, so um, how cool is that? I'll probably get some more too, some more carpet. And um, so that, that'd be good. <laughs> so, and uh, anyway, I hope you're having a great day. Keep trying to keep warm. I hate the cold weather, I really do. I hate this cold freezing. That's why I'm wearing mittens, because my hands play up the cold weather. I've got to try and protect them. And uh, yeah. So, anyway, yeah, I hope you're enjoying your day. <laughs> that looks good, eh? Yeah. There's my jigsaw puzzle. Still at it. It's going to take a while. Probably one of the uh, longest duration of the jigsaw puzzle <laughs> that I've ever done. <laughs> now, of course, it's winter solstice. It's a long night tonight, so it's about nine o'clock a.m. nine o'clock p.m. and uh, and I'm just going to take you outside. Now it is raining, so I can't stay out there for too long. Let's go for a walk out the front. <laughs> out the front. Winter at the winter solstice in the dark. <laughs> Here we go. Let's go. And the security light will come on as I go out there. So it's raining, it might get a bit wet, but I won't stay out there for long. I'm not going to do any talking, so we'll see how we go. <laughs> bit of a, a bit of a challenge. night the roses <laughs> very good are they listen to the rain rainy night on a winter solstice night on this Thursday night the longest night
had enough. really if you stay out there for too long you'll, you'll be cold it's not bad really out there it's not overly cold like they had in the last few nights it's been absolutely freezing and um, but because it's raining we're expecting rain you don't get that much coldness really <laughs> hope you enjoyed that oh yeah it's a wet day Wet Friday. <laughs> May Trev, welcome. Today is Friday, 23rd of June. And it's a wintry, wet weather day. And of course, it's winter solstice. Um, so, a short day. It was a short day yesterday and a short day today. So, <laughs> and uh, it's raining, absolutely raining. So this is expected, really. So anyway, I'm in town, so um, I've just been to the audiology for my um, he hearing aids. I had to get batteries for my hearing aids and get those hearing aids cleaned up a bit too as well so I can hear, so I can use them more clearer. So that's good, all done, all good. So now I'm going to town and do my errands, have a bit of lunch, just to chill out a bit. Yeah, trying somewhere <laughs> and of course this weekend of course um well actually i've got to go away filming on saturday for my bushland adventures channel so that'll be on saturday so and um, going to violet town this weekend yes and of course on sunday when am i going sunday taking peter out we're going to moela moela rsl club yes uh, the chinese restaurant there and um so that'll be good. I'm really looking forward to that. So then I'm going to my then we go into my sister's place um, for a while. So that's going to be our weekend. So it'll be good. It's out and about. So I hope it's not like this today in Violet Town tomorrow. Um, if it is, well, I might call it a day. I think. And of course, this weekend, um, the Bushland Adventures Channel um, filming. I'm gonna. This is going to be the, my last one. And I'm going to have a break, yes, until a little bit later in July. So then I'll start filming. So I've got lots of more adventures coming up for the rest of the year, and some are really exciting places. So I'm planning for. So anyway, I'm going to town. I hope you're having a great day. Stay, stay warm too. And stay out of the rain. <laughs> ah. What a wet day. <laughs> I'm at Big W car park. Yeah, underground. Yeah, so I've just had lunch. Thank you, Hollywoods. Hollywood pizza. Yeah, I had a pizza there for lunch just to chill out. Yeah, so it is raining, absolutely pouring out there at the moment. And uh, it's a, I guess it's winter, and we do need the rain, I guess. Um, I know you people will be saying, oh, shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Don't want the rain. <laughs> I don't want rain either. So, anyway, I'm going home and uh, get warm. <laughs> yes. I shall see you very shortly. May Trev, welcome. Today is Thursday, 29th of June. 29th of June. How is all going? And sorry, I haven't been vlogging very much. And, um, yes, of course... 29th of June, that means it's my mother's birthday. Yes, but she's no longer alive. And uh, she passed away in 2009. So on this day, 29th of June, she died on the 29th of December, 2009. And her birthday is on June 29th. So today is the 29th. Mum would be 87 today. Happy birthday, Mum. Gosh, I miss her. After all these years, I mean, it's a whole decade has gone. Oh, and um, she never made it into the tents. 
and um, of course my dad he never made it to the 20s so um, each died on two separate decades sort of thing you know so um, and of course my dad it's four years since my dad passed away and uh, that was um, 2019 that he passed away so yeah poor mum we've had a lot of had a lot of memories I mean mum mum and I uh, I took a touring many years ago back in 2001 or two I'm not too sure which one where I took her on a four-week tour I was doing concerts for the elderly people in the nursing homes and hostels and I took my mum with me and uh, we had a great time we just had a ball so we went up to Queensland and um, toured down along the coast of New South Wales, down to Coffs Harbour. I wanted to show the Gold Coast, so I showed her the Gold Coast and then just the weather up there, the weather up there was absolute magic. So um, it was a great tour, great memories and um, of my mum. And uh, yes, well, you know, at the time um, it was time to move along, didn't it? We've got to move along in our lives. So, um, yes, I hope you're having a great day. And uh, on this vlog, now i am sort of backdated some of the clips, um, some I took last week actually, so I haven't been putting them up, so you'll enjoy that. Uh, of course, the, the, with the winter solstice <laughs> we had last week, the winter solstice, so that's that'll be up on this um, video. So, Anyway, and um, I'm also having a bit of a break from um, Bushland Adventures channel, so um, I won't be doing any filming for another few weeks, and um, so I'll be back up and running. So my, I think my next, yeah, my next uh, video on that channel will be the 29th of June, so that's about four weeks time, in July, sorry, July, 29th of July. So, um... So I'm having a two-week break. So I'm having a break from filming and a break from uploading. So I'll be back into it. So my next adventure, of course, uh, will be Toganwall. Going to Toganwall, which is on the um, border of New South Victoria and New South Wales, right on the Murray River. And I've been there quite a few times, and um, I've always been wanting to film that um, town for my adventures. Yeah, so, and my last, my last adventure was Violet Town, Violet Town, the old abandoned race course, so um, dated back in the 1800s, so you'll see that this weekend, so I'm going to put that up, upload it uh, this weekend, you'll enjoy that. And uh, yes, of course, and last night we've been to the Railway Hotel open mic, and that was a really good night, we had a great night, and um, paying a bit of a tribute to my mate, uh, late Joe, Joe O'Keefe, of course, um, he passed away about last month ago, and that was in May, I think it was, yeah, I think it was May, <laughs> time's flying, isn't it, it really is, so I um, sang some songs, and I wrote a new song too, and I performed it last night for the very first time, so I'm going to do that on this vlog, do that for you, and then it's a song called Joe and I Didn't Say Goodbye. No, he didn't say goodbye. I never knew he died. It was very unexpected, really. So um, I wrote the song, and I'm going to record that. That'll be my next recording after I do the one I'm doing at the moment. Um, of course, I finished Western Star. The song, it's a truck song. And um, I'm in the process now at the moment recording. This is my third version of Lights on the Hill. Lights on the Hill is a trucky song written by... Well, the late Joy McKean, and of course she was a, a lady songwriter for the late Slim Dusty. And uh, Joy is a wonderful writer of songs, and um, I've actually recorded that twice, two times. Um, one on cassette back in 94, I think, 1994, and um, then I recorded it, I think it was 2014 or something like that, for a truck album, Along the Road, that's the name of the album. And so 
I was up in, up, up in the air where I was going to re-record it again for the Highway Truck album, the Highway album, and um, I thought, well, you know, it's a great song, I love it, and I've been singing it for a long time, and I thought, well, let's do it, let's do it, <laughs> Lights on the Hill. So I've got a few more song, truck songs to go on that album, and that'll be released in September, so we're looking forward to that, that'd be great, some great songs, great truck songs up, going up. And um, so at the moment, um, just about to re release uh, release um, Horses, Ponies and Rodeo album that's coming out from 10th of July. So um, that'll be released of this, um, of this month. So that's a great album to look forward to. It's, it's a good album. And uh, so there'll be many more. Of, there will be another album coming out in November, which I'm um, tipping for. Um, that would be called The Traveller. I wrote a song called The Traveller. Well, I'll probably finish it off. But there's still a lot of songs to write. And uh, I think that one of Joe, I did about Joe, Joe and I didn't say goodbye, um, that will go on that album. I want, to, I want that to be on that album. That will be in November. So I want to record it and it might come out as a single at the moment, a single, so I can get that air played. It's uh, just straight up as soon as I record it, you know, mix it and uh, get it released on a single. Maybe it's about four four other songs on the, an EP or something like that, just to have other songs to trial that that song. So anyway, and uh, of course now this here, you've probably seen that, my um, guitar with my photos on it. That one needs straightening up a little bit. What do you reckon? It's going to fall off, actually. They're only tic-tacked. That'll be all right. I'll fix it up. I've got another guitar case, which is the other half of the guitar case in my repair room, which I'm going to do with more photos. So I've got to search for more photos. Yeah. And I'm still working on the jigsaw puzzle, yes. Slowly getting there. It's going to still taking a while. It's not an easy jigsaw puzzle. <laughs> not very easy at all. Usually at night time when I, I just listen to music and um, when working on my jigsaw puzzle, I do that at night time. Yeah, so when it's good. I hope you're having a great day. Now, what am I going to be doing? Yes, well. Since my mum had her birthday day, today, she would have been 87, God bless my mum, having her birthday, and um, something else, somebody else is having a birthday as well, yes, Vegemite, <laughs> 100 years of Vegemite today, so let's celebrate, yes. Uh, now, all you Americans who don't like, or well, haven't, I don't know whether you've eaten Vegemite before or anything like that, but you know, <laughs> use the butter first, Trev. Yes, I love butter. Just spread your butter. You need plenty of it. Yes, when it comes to Vegemite. You spread it on your bread. I like it with toast, really. <clears throat> yeah. And a little bit of Vegemite, Australian Vegemite. Now, you won't need as much as what you have with, as butter. Just have a little bit. Yes. Now, I've done this before. I oh, know, you've seen it. <laughs> Just spread it. So, you need more butter or margarine than the Vegemite because it tastes creamier mm. Mm. Happy 100th birthday Vegemite Yes mm. Now, there's something else 
well, they're not having a birthday, but they could have given them another four years, then it'll be a be hundred. Yes. And that is the fantails. Fantails, they're actually lollies. They've been around for, I think, about 97 years. I think that's what it is. 97 years. But very sadly, fantails, mm, they're going out of production. So they're not going to make them anymore. And uh, so we had our Vegemite that's turned to 100. Given another few more years, the, fan the fantails will turn 100 as well. I remember these. We used to go into the pictures. Suck them on the fantails. Yeah. Well. Who am I? I need a pair of glasses for these. <laughs> Who am I? Born in Louisville, Kentucky, on August, what's it, August 16, 1990. I think that's what it is. <laughs> I'm getting old as what well, well, Fantails is older than me, of course. <laughs> and I'm getting older too, I guess. They all got tails on them, anyway. But they're the fantails. Been around for a long while. Mm -hmm. mm. You'd probably be saying, where'd you get those? I've been out shopping. Well, I'm not going to tell you. I'm not going to tell you. It's a secret. Otherwise, everybody would be grabbing them. <laughs> so they'll no longer be around. So I've got them. Fantails. <laughs> Okay, now I'm going to finish this vlog, and uh, before I do, uh, before I sing this song, um, of course, now this weekend, um, Trev's Bushland Adventures, don't forget to jump on there on the weekend. On Saturday, there will be an upload of my next video, and also Sunday could possibly be um, on my Trevor Dawson channel, right on this channel. Uh, That'll be the uh, Trev's Memory Lane, part 63. Yes, that'll be on Sunday, possibly. So, um, you'll enjoy that. So, until next time, of course, it's the end of June, and we're coming into July. And uh, so, I'm going to take it out now with a finish this song. I mean, finish this vlog, <laughs> video, and uh, it's all about Joe, my mate Joe. Not my own mate. But it's everybody's mate as well. It's called Old Joe. It's called Joe and I didn't say goodbye. Well, we listen to Hank Williams songs, TV Rogers, Love Sick Blues. Such rock and rock, country music too. The good old times were surrounding us, joy without a sigh. Tears were never heard of, Joe and I say goodbye. Well, Jesus was calling him.
Joe.